So hey guys, it's your host Mr. Nam Stan today I'm back with a new amazing video guys. So one of the most uh, thing which you have recently may have seen on Instagram uh, that many uh, great pages have been uploading uh, many videos like this and basically what was the concept of this whole video is the image is still but they add up the animation to this whole image. So I'm going to show you a simple uh, tutorial guys how to you could also really make uh, some videos like this. So now let me just show you another video for instance uh, as you could see uh, the guy is still and the flames are animated here so you could also basically do this whole shit up guys so let us start with this whole video about how to animate any of the images I know this is really dope but let's get started uh, basically first of all what you need to do is just go ahead and just download the Plotograph Pro uh, app from the description uh, you, I will just put the link in the description guys so just go ahead and just download this whole thing so once you have downloaded this stuff guys it will just send you a uh, uh, email verification thing and after that it will just uh, tell you to download the trial version of this software and once you that just go ahead and select your uh, operating system so in my case it is window 32 bit and th that's it so once you've done once you have done with this now just go ahead and install this and boom so once you're there it will basically ask for the login part so just go ahead and just log in where with your account existing uh, existing account uh, here and once you're done with the login part now let's just go ahead and just create a new plotograph image itself so once you're there guys basically you will see uh, some tabs like this so what you need to do is just click on this plus icon and there you will see an option called plotograph plotograph basically i really don't know how to spell this shit up so yeah so once you're there now just uh, name it anything so now let me i'm renaming it as new master and yeah so once you're there now just go ahead and choose the file which you really want uh, to animate so in my case just for a uh, uh, instant i'm just uh, using this image itself so this guy is basically me hi there and yeah so once you're there just go ahead and tap on create and it will take some time so i would really suggest you guys to uh, go to the view tab and do this whole thing in the full screen mode so yeah so so once you're here guys uh, you may have noticed that there were two concepts uh, behind this image so one of the most important uh, concept was that some of the elements were not moving and some of the elements were moved and they were animated so so basically what you need to do is just go ahead and you will see a uh, lady uh, that is the logo itself just tap on here and you will see basically these are the two points so one is the animation points and another is the stabilizer uh, stabilizer points so animation points are those points which you will make them to animate and the stabilizers points are those uh, which will make the image still itself first of all now now i will really suggest you to use the stabilizer point itself so what you need to do is just put this whole point around the corner of uh, around the sides of uh, the the image itself or the thing which you really don't want to move uh, in the uh, in this whole video so in in uh, so as in this case i am i don't want this uh me to be moving <laughs> with this whole thing otherwise uh everything will be start moving uh with this guy itself so now let me just show you so what you really need to keep in mind here is that whenever you try to plot the points around the sides of the thing make that uh, make sure that it is close as it is so if you uh, if you uh, if you have a lot of distance between each point then it will also make uh, the thing also to move with uh, the the animation itself so we are done with this part guys now what we really need to do is now we have to just move this whole thing so as in my case i really want to move this uh, whole uh, uh, water and the sky uh, and I want this guy to be still as from my concept so just go ahead and now just select the animation point guys now what you need to do is just give the small distance just put the uh, arrow with a small distance of, of uh, at the direction where this whole thing will really move so in my case I'm also moving the water from left to right in my case here as you can basically see and the next thing is the this wave so i want it to come forward so it will really look cool so 
so now if i play this whole thing for you now it will play something like this as you could see it has been animated and everything has been moving even the water and the clouds so yeah so another uh, thing i really want to tell with you all guys that whenever you try to put this animation point make sure that the distance is not very long so now let me just show you the disadvantage of the animation point so if in case i'm using a very uh i could say very long long uh animation points like this one as you could see so this may be the disadvantage of using the animation points very uh, with a long arrow itself so as you could see it is getting uh, scattered uh, basically yeah, another thing is the direct select tool guys if you really want to remove all those points you could just go ahead and select all the points uh, basically these were the points and I selected them and just tap on delete and boom every points have been removed by this direct select tool so yeah so i wanted to animate this cloud so just go ahead to animation points once again so it will be really cool if i uh, drag them to upwards so as i said make sure that the direct arrow is small so it will really give a perfect animation move so now just go ahead and now let's play this whole final video how it will really look like so this is how guys uh, our final image is really looking and as you could see the water waves are coming forward and the clouds are moving upwards and the waves are coming front so this was a simple basic video guys uh, about how to really animate this whole things uh, if you were really confused uh, on the instagram how these guys were really doing this whole thing click on this export image and it will just to show you the two option that is plotograph plotograph export or the custom export i'll just ask you to do the custom export is, uh, itself and just tap on this export tab so before starting uh, finally i just want to tell you guys that if you are doing this whole trial version you you may only do the uh, export thing up to three times only so that's it so watching this whole video guys i hope this video is really helpful and if it is really guys please hit that like button and smash that subscribe button for showing your support so till the bye guys your host mr nanster have a good day see you in the next video signing out